Hello guys, welcome to my channel Python Educare. Today I have brought another interesting session which is how to print a file via print driver using Python program. If you can see this, I have al already written the code. Today I will show you what each code does and how each code can be written up so that like it will be easy for you while you are performing any such activities. If you have not subscribed my channel yet, so please do subscribe my channel so that you can find such uh, informative videos in future. So let us see how to write this program. I will be using a module called Pavin Auto. So let us see import Pavin Auto and then time is for delaying our Python script uh, execution. Then from Pavin Auto application we will be importing an import application and then from Pavin Auto keyboard we will be importing the send keys. So like we will be importing some uh, key keywords so first thing so what I'm going to do is I'm going to open a file the python dot file this particular PDF file and then I will be from there I will be just uh, print that file so this is my file so let this file opens and then I'll be pressing control P manually so what will happen is like a print dialog will open now from this dialog my driver is print, print driver and then I will be selecting the properties this is my print driver open then in this print driver I will be setting some parameters say what the job job type what type of a print job I want then what paper size I need to select for and whether it is two side or one side print whether it is a color or mono so I will be selecting the print standard and uh, output destination and a couple of other features from the other tabs say from here I will be selecting some page layout options and from advanced I will be selecting some copy counts so these are the basic features I will be using for doing a print job using python program so let us see how to write the code so now if you see here first thing is like let me have the program path so similarly like since this is a python file I cannot directly open this file so I need to I need to open this file using adobe reader so first you need to find out where is the Adobe Reader location. So my Adobe Reader is uh, located in this location. So there's the sets a path I have given. So why I put R is like to avoid this uh, Unicode string errors. So this is the reason I have put R here. Same way, similar way for file path also. For file path, this is the file path that I mentioned. Users, desktop, geo automation, and then Python file. So I have the program path as well as I have the file path. Now, how do I start this uh, application? to open this file so app is equal to application then start and this R then format program path and file path so with this your file will open next I have put time dot slip three seconds so sometimes based on the systems right sometimes it will be a little slow it will be lagging so that's the reason it will wait for three seconds for the for the file to open now once the once the file is opened so what I will use like I will send a key Control P. So this is Control and P. So there is Control Print. So I will be using Print and then I will wait for some four seconds. So there are many other keywords. So you can go to this uh, uh, Pivin Auto uh, page. So I will be mentioning this uh, link in my description. You can go to this description and there are many other uh, keys, uh, code, key codes are available. So you can easily use this for your uh, program. Next, what I'm going to do is like once it is Control P, so I will have the uh, print driver option enabled. Now, next, what I'm going to do is it's a different window. Next, I got a print window. This is a different window. So what I will I will be coding is like I will be asking my Python to find a window with title called print. To find a window with title called print. So w handle is pywin auto dot find windows dot find underscore windows title is equal to print so it will look for this particular uh, window with title print once this it finds so it will open catch hold that window and then it will wait for that window to be ready else it will get timed out after 10 seconds next 
next once i once this uh, print window is uh, ready in the ready state so what i'm going to dislike i will be using inspect.exe this tool i will be using this tool to find out the properties of each object this is a very useful tool and it can be used in various way to find out the objects uh, for any GUI application. Now what I'm going to do is like, first I'm going to select the printer, what the printer is. So I will be selecting driver. So what I'm going to do is window.u printer comma com, com box, combo box, right? So how I'm getting it is like printer. So if you see driver, right? So if you come here, If you come here it says combo box localized control type is combo box then it need to select as printer combo box already we have told right cc if you see here prin under n we have a underscore here so that means pri ampersand and ter so similar way printer uh, then combo box dot select zero so for combo box we will be using select and this is the list item so once in this uh, combo box we have this uh, list items so we can either mention with a string name or we can put index so 0 is driver 1 is fax 2 is uh, micros xps 3 is one node so now since I've, I need to use the driver option so I will be selecting 0 so that's driver next what is going to do is like window u properties dot click next once the driver have been selected so I need to next option is time to select this property option so if you see the it is also a button localized control type is button and the name is properties so we can i will be clicking this properties so i'll be waiting for some eight seconds then next is time dot slip eight seconds now next what i've done is now another since i have another window open so i will be select i will be using the same uh window finding options say like w handle one pi win auto find windows find windows now this time I have not selected a title I have used best match why because uh, based on your driver selection this properties title will differ so, but in all the cases you will have a properties in common so that's the reason I put best match equal to properties so it will search for the particular of window with properties so it will wait for 10 seconds and then it will quit so once the window is found so it will hold to the window next what is going to do is like window one job type combo box select sample set now when this window is open so what it is going to do is like i need to click to this combo box so if you see this this is a localized control based combo box and once i click this we have a list open so if you see list items if you see the localized control is list items now so from here i will be selecting sample set if you see here i have selected here sample set next again like we have window one two sided printing combo box so these are all combo boxes if i see like if i click on all these are all combo boxes so this inspect tool is very useful in finding out the object types for your uh, test automation so now i have selected for this one sided print so make sure like this list items right this name should be matching to what you're writing if something one space is more or if you have caps on with that also we will be having issues so make sure like this name string name and the string here should match next once it is done the next one i'm going to select like, i will be selecting the paper type select paper so this window i will be clicking this window so this is called which is the name is select paper so we have space here but make sure uh, while writing the code the space should be omitted you should put select paper only and then click input so nothing you can uh, you can press click also so click means like uh, it will uh, the, if, uh, while running the automation script you will not see the mouse coming over here and click while you use click but while you use click underscore input the mouse will come here and click over here so once it is clicked what is going to do is like i will be using some key called send keys vk down means down arrow then right arrow then again if you see send keys right right now what i'm going to do is like I will be send keys VK down. So I will be selecting down and I will be selecting the word letter. I will be pressing enter. Okay. 
next done next again what i'm going to do is like i'll be collecting the select paper click input then now i will be selecting for trace so i'll go for uh, one down two down three down four down then right click around tray one now i'll be selecting enter so it will select for tray one letter next next what i'm going to be select i will be similar way i will be selecting for xerox black and white combo box i will be using on then similar way i will be using for all other things like for standard i will be using some uh, high resolution then once it is done i will be going like moving to the next uh, tab so there is called document option so make sure like these are all tab options so what i'm going to select these are all tab controls so window dot one tab control dot select u document options so if i click here you can see like these are all tab items so tab control options so tab control so there's the reason like i have written window one dot tab control dot select you document options so it will it will go to that options and then from here this page i need to select one uh, two pages per sheet if you see here i have written window one two pages per sheet click so this is also radio button type so if you see the, uh, the type is radio button so if you click here it will click two pages per sheet next i need to go to printing option so now if i go to print option i i cannot use the same uh, tab control because if I use tab control, it will look for these tab controls. So for this, I need to select tab control 2. So with tab control 2, I will be going to what page? I will be going to advanced page. If I see here, you can see I am going moving to advanced page. And then I will be editing this one. Type keys equal to 5. So I, I will be writing here 5. This with 5. Okay. So then next what I'm going to do next window dot one okay so once it is done so window one this particular window and then I will be pressing OK button so once this is done I will be pressing OK button so next I will be coming to this window again then I will be pressing window first window with this is window one now this is the first window window dot print so it will be clicking this print option so always make sure first tab will be app means app or window dot that particular uh, title window title or app title dot the method you are calling that is how your pywin auto program will work so let's see by running this program properties it will now open the print driver window so it is opened it and you see like it is not functioning as it is intended to print. if you see like it is printing in progress so I got a message because there is no printer in my system printer connected to my system so hope you have understood this video uh, if you need any help you can always uh, write down to me in my email ID which is flashing over here so that I can help you out with the for your query if you have liked my video Please press like button and for more videos, please do subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.